many students who are in last year of engineering or they have completed their engineering or mca and now trying to learn data science and data analytics they have asked me this question that whether fresher can directly get a job as a data scientist or they have to start their career as a data analyst now there is a common misconception within the student community right now that they can start their job in data industry only as a data analyst and there is a no chance to get a job as a data scientist so guys i have been working in data science and ai field from last 10 years and in this video i would share my observations related to this point let's get started now before i get into whether you can get a job as a data scientist as a fresher let me tell you what is the difference between data analyst and data scientist now as a data analyst your main skill sets which would be needed are basics of python programming sql then a visualization tool like tableau or power bi and knowledge of advanced excel in some roles and for data scientist role you need to know a good knowledge in python programming sql programming and knowledge of machine learning models now if you compare these two roles the two differentiators between data analyst and data scientist role is in data science role you need to have better knowledge of python programming and you need to understand machine learning models as well now if you think of these technologies from the learning point of view even students as well as working professionals both of them can comfortably learn python as well as machine learning so i don't see any challenge why students won't be able to learn these technologies so from the learning point of view there is no challenge at all now when it comes down to the job market in data analyst basically there are large number of opportunities which are available and the reason for that is data analyst is a wider umbrella so even roles which require basic knowledge of sql and advanced excel are counted as a data analyst role and these roles really require basic skill sets and it is easy to get the role these kind of roles as freshers and that's why you would see that many freshers actually end up becoming data analyst now if you compare this with data science role for data science role there is a higher competition the reason for that is data science roles are futuristic roles people who start working as a data scientist they have better career opportunities better career growth and a higher compensation as well so guys wherever there is a high compensation for any role many people would try to apply for that role so you have to be well prepared to get those kind of roles now why students are struggling to get data science role i have done a very good study on this particular topic and i found that there are two main reasons why students struggle to get data science roles roles are there but students are struggling to get those roles and there are two main reasons for that the first reason is when students are learning data science they are not learning it in a right way so most of the students are just going through the machine learning theoretical topics they are not building lot of projects and whatever projects they build i have seen that they are building common projects like stock price prediction sentiment analysis house price prediction titanic survival prediction every student is trying to build these three or four projects or maybe they are copying it from the internet i don't know and then they are putting it those projects on their cv now you tell me if as a student if everyone is building same kind of projects and when you apply for data science roles how you can stand out with those kind of projects you have to build industry relevant projects guys and if you are targeting data science roles i would recommend you to build projects where the data sets are really large and focus on some domains so let's say that you build some projects related to financial domain or you build some projects related to manufacturing domain and then accordingly target the roles so this is the first reason guys not learning data science in a right way and not building right kind of projects because of that students struggle to get interview calls now those who get interview calls they are not well prepared for the interview so many students think that they don't have to prepare very thoroughly for the data science interview and if they give few interviews they would be able to crack at least one see that too would work only when you are well prepared for data science interview because in the interview people would ask you python sql and machine learning questions so i would recommend you to prepare thoroughly and that would help you to get the data science roles so this is the first reason why students are struggling not learning things in a right way and not building right kind of projects the second reason is basically the reason of market now this is not the reason which is something in hand of students right now what happens is whenever there is any new technology and companies want to build their team initially they would tend to hire experienced candidates so candidates let's say who have any kind of working experience in the industry and they have learned data science or experienced data scientists any form of these two candidates would work the reason for that is when you are initially setting up your team you need people who have some kind of working experience you cannot directly set up the team with freshers and data science is comparatively a new technology in the market 
this is why many companies when setting up their team they are preferring to hire some experienced candidates and this is another reason why freshers are struggling but if you think of a trajectory of any technology whatever technology which came in the past java web development mobile app development this is the same trajectory initially they would prefer the experienced candidates but as the technology becomes more and more mature actually the lot of hiring would happen at the fresher and entry level so if you guys are learning data science and ai you would definitely get the advantage of it because eventually lot of hiring is going to happen at the entry level and not at the experience level so please try to understand this as well now if you are a student and you want to become a data scientist what should be your strategy now let me answer that as well see your strategy should be aim high aim for the data scientist role guys learn python sql machine learning and also learn the visualization tools like tableau and power bi build the industry level capstone projects get this pro- those projects on your cv prepare thoroughly for the interviews and start targeting internship as well as full time roles in data science if you are well prepared if you have built right kind of projects you can definitely get a data science role as a fresher as well and after doing those applications let's say for one or two months if you think that you are struggling to crack those roles and you are able to get let's say data analyst role or something in python development then definitely take that there is no need to wait for 6 months just to get data science role even if you are getting data analyst role or a python development role take that role guys work over there for one or two years build your cv and then your cv actually becomes even more relevant for the data science role and then you can eventually become data scientist so you can look at that journey as a journey of 0 to 2 years based on whether you are able to crack immediately or you need some form of industrial experience before cracking that data science role but if you take this kind of a approach you can make switch into data science role with 100% assurance but if you try to get it immediately and if you are very stubborn but you are not building right kind of projects not working on interview preparation then you are going to struggle for sure so all the best guys you can take this approach and this would definitely work for you to eventually become data scientist so make sure you are building the right projects and applying to the right kind of companies if you have any questions for me just let me know in the comments i will be happy to answer those thanks for watching the video and i will see you in the next one bye bye